name is Benjamin Ruttenberg. I'm the director for the Cal Poly Center for Coastal Marine Sciences. The Cal Poly Pier is a research facility in Avila Beach that allows our faculty to teach classes and conduct research and gives our students amazing opportunities to learn on the water. The pier has classroom space, laboratory space, and a flow through seawater lab that allows us to run a range of studies and experiments with live organisms under realistic conditions. Our marine science program provides our students with amazing learn by doing opportunities in classroom and research settings. The pier is a tool that provides them with easy access to the marine environment that would be hard to get any other way. All of this allows them to grow and develop as citizens and scientists. By maintaining the pier, we will ensure that students have these learning opportunities for years to come. Our facilities and capabilities at the pier are excellent, but there's always more work to be done. We'd like to grow our research capabilities to address the toughest challenges facing our oceans and continue training the next generation of marine scientists, ocean advocates, and problem solvers. I'm Dr. Alexis Pasolka, and I'm an assistant professor in the biology department. The students in my research group come out to the pier weekly and take an instrument, lower it into the ocean, and measure things like temperature, salinity, and we use bottles called Niskin bottles to collect seawater samples to bring back organisms on deck, and we look at microscopic creatures in these samples. So everything from the smallest entity in the oceans, viruses, to phytoplankton, those are the tiny plant-like creatures in the ocean, to zooplankton, those are the small crustacean-like creatures in the ocean, and we try to understand how all of those things, the physics, the chemistry, and the biology, are interacting with one another in the ocean. The pier really provides us the opportunity to train the next generation of marine scientists, and our goal is to provide them with hands-on training in state-of-the-art oceanographic equipment, such that whether they go into education, research, or government, they've now become ocean literate. So they have an appreciation for how the ocean functions and how we study it.